Okay, so I guess we can start. Okay, sounds good. All right, so so I'll get started. Uh, so I just wanted to make a couple quick thank yous uh, on behalf of myself and uh, Sebastian. Uh, so some thank yous. All right, so the uh, first set of people I'd like to thank is our sort of Concordia team. Uh, in particular, Marie France, Maria and Jessica, they worked really hard behind the scenes uh, they did everything. The website that you used uh, was was basically put up by them and, and programmed by them. They did all the registration. They found Yo Tribe. If you love Yo Tribe and, and think it was a cool hallway track, that's uh, credit goes to them. Uh, they did the accounting. They answered questions and, and things like that. So uh, we're very grateful to them. Uh, there were some other people at Concordia as well, uh, more behind the scenes uh, that helped out with uh, some of the technical issues and, and some of the accounting issues as well. Uh, another person I'd like to personally thank is Ryan. Uh, he was video chair, but he stepped up. He ran an entire track. Uh, his track is uh, in the picture. You can see it's marked as excellent uh, by YouTube, whereas Sebastian and I are only good. Uh, and he did an excellent job. Uh, so, so we're really appreciative of him. And it's, it's a lot of work, actually, because you have to sit in front of your computer. You have to you know, press play on the talks, make sure the sound works, stop it, you know, unmute people and things like that. So it's, you know, when you have a bunch of kids like I know he does, it's, it's hard to, to take that amount of time out of the day. So uh, thanks to him. Uh, no thanks to Firefox. Uh, we asked that, that people uh, send their videos through Firefox Send. Uh, it worked right up until the deadline. So authors could send it to us through Firefox Send. But then the day after, uh, when we went to download them all, they decided that that was a good time to uh, schedule some maintenance, maintenance that lasted days. Uh, so anyways, it, it wasn't a big problem in the end. but. I thought I'd mention that. And then last uh, but not least, uh, thanks to all the people uh, on the pets uh, side. So Aaron and Costas as the program chairs, Ryan, who, who we already mentioned, uh, CAD and, and the, the publicity chairs and the web chairs as well. Uh, people who did the sponsorship, the award, uh, the board, we asked them lots of questions and, and we got lots of good feedback uh, all the way around. So uh, thanks to all of you. And uh, thanks to my university as well. They gave a small cash contribution and uh, that's it. So thank you very much. All right, thanks, Jeremy. Uh, okay, so let me share my screen. Okay. So yeah, by the way, I think Firefox sent they completely um, uh, stopped their service for for some time because the because of some abuse, malware abuse, something like that. So I don't know if if people. Uh, sending videos via, via the service had anything to do with that. <laughs> but yeah, it happened. Anyway, so um, all right, that's my, my turn to, to thank uh, a, a lot of people. Basically, thank all, all you because, um, uh, I mean, pets is, is possible because of the, of the hard work and participation of a huge number of, of people. So either your uh, author or, or PC member or ActiveFact um, review committee members, uh, special thanks to, to, to them who um, um, helped a lot this year to, to bootstrap this um, uh, this uh, procedure. Um, all the external reviewers, uh, we had plenty of them. Uh, the shepherds, that's a lot of work, and we really ap appreciate um, uh, spending this, this time to uh, really help with, with the, uh, the papers, um, like for the for the last mile, let's say, of, uh, of the papers making it um, to the proceedings. Uh, proof reviewer. Um, all the participants, of course. So I, I counted to 47. So Jeremy said that uh, there are a bit more. So I'm personally quite happy uh, given the circumstances with uh, uh, the participation. Uh, thanks, of course, to all the speakers uh, for uh, um, presenting your, your papers and submitting them to, uh, to PETS. Um, all great works, um, our invited speaker and, and session chairs. So many thanks to all of you. Um, and of course, more people all, all doing uh, volunteering work, uh, which is very, very important for, for um, organizing something as big as, uh, as pets. So Walter and Michael for our hot pets, um, Simone and, and, and Ross um, for the awards, Rachel and Steven for the sponsorship, um, Roger Emiliano, Damon and Andre for uh, stipends, uh, Vasilis and Tobias for the publications, um, Matt, um, for uh, being the liaison with the, the publisher. Um, Ryan Henry, again, thanks a lot. So um, he did much more than uh, uh, what he signed up for. Um, 
Kat and Baker uh, for the publicity, Ian and Kat for web, and Nikita and Nick, who did a wonderful job with the student paper uh, award on a, on a short notice. And of course, huge thank to, to Jeremy and Sebastian who wanted to uh, make pets at, in Montreal and ended up in the middle of uh, a pandemic organizing virtual uh, events. So that's not an easy job to do. And I think they did a wonderful uh, job with, of course, the help of all the people that Jeremy mentioned. Uh, and of course, thanks uh, to our sp sponsors, uh, Ford Foundation, um, Facebook, and, and Tor. Uh, many thanks to all of them who uh, helped. Uh, uh, making uh, pets uh, a reality. All right, so let's talk about the, the future. So uh, we are in a weird position to announce the, um, the location for both pets 2021 uh, and uh, 2021 and 2022. So this will be Sydney and Lausanne. However, we're not in position to announce the order in which this will happen. So uh, initially, the, the, the plan was uh, pets uh, next year to uh, take place in Sydney. Uh, however, we start realizing now that maybe, uh, and, and that was a great thing. So for the first time that pets would, would uh, take place outside the um, uh, US uh, or Europe. Um, uh, well, uh, North America, say, or Europe. Um, and uh, yeah, that was great. Um, however, taking this huge step um, amid uh, uh, um, a pandemic, uh, maybe it's not the best idea. Uh, so the plan was for, for uh, PETS 2022 to take place in Lausanne, but they might swap. So we don't know uh, this yet. So we are, we are monitoring the, the situation. Uh, and of course, we have no idea whether it's going to be a virtual event, a hybrid event, uh, a traditional event. So all this will depend, of course, on, on how COVID, um, um, what's happening with, with, with COVID. So. Anyway, so good, good news, although not very specific news. Uh, and of course, um, the, the submissions for 2021 have already started. So many of you have already submitted for the, the first issue. Notifications are due uh, soon. Um, and if you haven't, there are still three issues. So plenty of time, uh, prepare, bring your best papers and help making the next uh, uh, pets um, even greater success than, uh, than the previous ones. All right, so um, yeah, so the general chairs for the next two um, conferences. So they're gonna be, oh, we don't know the order uh, again, but uh, so when it happens in, in Sydney, uh, Dali Kafar is gonna be the general chair there and many thanks uh, to him. Uh, and when it happens in, in Lausanne, uh, so Kevin Genan and Carmela Troncoso, they're gonna um, be in charge. And then uh, again, many thanks to, to them for um, uh, stepping up and uh, uh, organizing pets. Um, and uh, of course, the program chairs. Uh, so every year there is uh, one chair who is um, uh, stepping down, and that's going to be uh, me. I'm finally free from uh, from pets after two years, and can finally submit my own papers uh, to the conference. Um, and uh, so uh, Florian Kersbaum is taking my place. Uh, so for for um, uh, for 2021, uh, together with Aaron, of course. And the news for 2022. Uh, then Aaron will step down, and then Michel Mazurek uh, is going to take his, play, uh, his place together with, with Florian. Um, so uh, these are all, all super great news, and, and I'm sure that, that pets will continue uh, uh, be a great success with the help of, of these people. So many thanks to all of them. All right, um, and of course, um, um, many more chairs uh, doing various um, uh, works around around uh, organizing uh, pets. And uh, so for, for hot, hot pets, uh, so Ryan Henry is going to be um, Michael's uh, co-chair co for hot pets uh, uh, next year. Um, then uh, Tobias and Anselme uh, will take care of the publications. Um, Kat and Ken Becker will uh, still doing the publicity. Uh, Cecilia will still take uh, uh, care of artifacts. Uh, then Jeremy Clark will uh, bring his uh, know-how um, and, and um, um, be the, the video chair for next year. And Ian and Kat uh, are going to be the web chairs. Uh, and uh, a few more chairs are going to be um, decided in the next uh, board meeting. All right, so we have uh, the next two pets already decided. Um, however, there's still 2023. 20, uh, um, there's no rush. So the proposals are due next year in September. But um, 
if you feel like um, organizing uh, pets and, and having uh, pets in, in, in your city, your university, um, so uh, consider submitting a, a, a proposal. Right, so uh, send it to, to, to the board. Uh, and of course, if you have uh, questions, uh, so um, uh, how is pets organized? Uh, what are the, the criteria? And uh, uh, what do I need to know um, for making a good proposal? So ask, ask any member of the, of the board. Uh, 